I just jump down? How high is it? Yeah, broken legs won't matter. <laughs> well, hello there. Sorry about Freddy and Trixie. When they're not fighting over salvage, they're fighting over the bed sheets at night. No worries, no worries. Uh, those two are a couple? They like to blow off steam during work hours, but as soon as they clock out, they turn into a pair of kittens. Welcome to the Sprat Shack. First one's on the house, and I won't even water it down. Will it be? So they're together, and they were arguing about the stuff that they were essentially going to be taking home regardless. Money-wise, I'm like, let's say they sold all the scrap. It was not going to go home regardless, right? So I think they were uh, overreacting just a tad bit. Like, I understand if you want to separate your assets and stuff. That's actually a prob uh, probably a very smart thing to do. However... It's probably not as a big deal as they're making it seem. Uh, let me see. Welcome to the Sprat Shack for, uh, for uh, water down. What would it be? Make it pur per uh, purple berry. I'm in a chipper mood. Bottoms up. Not every day that Sublight's vice president strolls in through the front door. You here on business? Uh, you could say that. Yeah, not sublight business, but you could say that. We don't get a lot of you VIP types around here. <laughs> Let me know if you need anything special. Ooh, like I what? I assume you're here for salvage. Uh... Not exactly, but can you explain what you mean? Most of my regulars are sublight scavengers. They pick over the ruins of Gorgon, spend their earnings at the bar, and uh, head back out the next day. Vicious cycle, but that's life. You're the first new face I've seen in a while. Is that so? You know anyone uh, by the name of Lucky Montoya? Lucky? Sure, I knew him. He could get a little dramatic at times, but he was a good guy. Heard he took on a dangerous job. Spent a lot of time coming and going from the Office of Creative Incubation. Ah. Just down the road. Oh. Sounds like a place that I need to get to. So, Office of Creative uh, creative Incubation? That's where the top rungers at Spacer's Choice came up with slogans of marketing. Lucky never told me why it was so important. Uh, awful shame about what happened to him. So, what did happen to him, actually? You really want to hear my story? Yep. <laughs> Lol. Most everyone around here is sick to death of it by now. Last I saw of Lucky was a few days ago. I went outside for a smoke and a stroll, and I saw this wild canid dragging a bloody limb. So I kicked the canid, scared it off. Uh... <laughs> this, this isn't a dumb dialogue, but I'm gonna say it because it sounds stupid. Uh, why not just let the canid enjoy the juicy limb? If the bloody piece in question was a raptodon tongue or a mantis leg, we wouldn't be having this conversation. <laughs> Get this. The canid was chewing on an honest-to-law human arm. Lucky's arm. Wait. Is that... Did she send the package to us? How do you know it belonged to Lucky? I'm a bartender. Attention to detail is my middle name. No. Anyway. Okay. The arm was clutching a phonograph that mentioned uh. someone named Alex Hawthorne. I did some poking around, and this Hawthorne has a reputation among the uh, <clears throat> salvagers who she did the send bar. it. So I packaged up the arm nice and tidy and sent it care of the Halcyon Parcel Service. They even gave me a discount on the hazardous waste removal stamp. She was the one who sent the package. Yeah, the arm made it to me. I'm Alex Hawthorne's next of kin. Uh, sort of. <laughs> no kidding. And now you're here? Colony feels smaller than you'd think some days. I'm glad I was here to see this uh, confluence of events, you know? The stars really aligned on this one. Yeah, you wouldn't. And here you I don't am, say. Smack dab in the middle. So why bother sending the, the arm at all? I figured Hawthorne would want to know what happened to his pal. Help Lucky get his affairs in order, you know. Oh, I hate to see people go with unfinished business. Well, my only question is, if you're going to send it, I get, I get her intentions, but did she have to send the arm too? <laughs> she could have just removed the arm, right? Okay, well, anyways, where was Lucky staying? Third floor. 
Once I figured he wasn't coming back to pay his tab, Man, I, I just got back from there. to air it out. You can help yourself to anything you left behind. Fair warning, I've been letting the regulars use it for a quick lie down. Ah. Wash your hands when you're done. Trust me. Lie down in uh with an asterisk next to it. <laughs> Wonder what the lie down means exactly. Anyways, uh so what do you know about Gorkin? Spacer's Choice used to brew pharmaceuticals in these parts. That's why the asteroid smells like an old gym sock. <laughs> they say Adrena time came from here. Just oh, that's down cool. Down the road at the old R and D lab. Very hush hush back in the day. That's pretty cool. I guess this is where it came from. Uh, why would any regulars have more information about Gorgon? Roscoe might tell you more. He spent some time around here before the bar opened up. I trust him well enough. There's always Leonora, my favorite customer over in the storage room on the second floor. We met to herself and always closes out her tab. So what, uh, what can you tell me about Leonora? Nice lady. Been coming around a lot these past few months. She isn't with Sublight, but seems to know the lay of the land better than anyone. She spends most of her days drinking alone. I think she's looking to hire someone. If you're open to a side gig. Already done. Uh, she and her husband worked on Gorgon before it all fell apart. No kidding. Yeah, Ugh, it's a pretty sad shame. story. I owe her one on the house. <clears throat> when Spacer's Choice pulled out, a lot of people found themselves adrift. The ones with nowhere to settle ended up here. Sad but true. I'm glad I I'm glad that I told her. At least she can get some sympathy from Lex. So what's Roscoe's story? He's been here since opening day. I think he told me he was some kind of journalist. He is. He got left behind when Spacer's Choice pulled out. And I guess no one's coming to get him. No, they're not. Uh, so why did he get left behind? He didn't tell me and I didn't ask. I'm his bartender, not his human resources rep. <laughs> if you believe the chatter, a lot of good folks got left behind and a lot of bad folks made it out. Sometimes that's all there is to it. Yeah. Poor bastard. You look out for him? Roscoe's drinks are on the house. We all know how it feels to get left behind. He'll be all right. He's with the family now. And we take care of our own. She is super sweet. Tough. She's firm. Tough, but sweet. Like, she, she's a very good balance. I really like this character, actually. Thanks for the tip. What are friends for, eh? Hey, appreciate it. Any idea why Spacer's Choice uh, shut down uh, Gorgon? I doubt anyone knows the full story. One day the evacuation order went out. Grunts and lab coats scrambled to get anywhere but Gorgon. And the weirdest thing of all, Adrena time still hit the market. Me, I never touch the stuff. To each their own, but I think it's dangerous. Dangerous why? I don't know. Uh, salvagers must be making a fortune off of Gorgon though, right? Damn right we are. We've got drugs, scrap metal, prototype weapons, drugs, money, and Prototype wardrobe. weapons. When Spacer's Choice evacuated, everyone dropped their gear and ran. Most of it stayed where it fell, and all of it is up for grabs. Of course, the real treasure is whatever's locked up in the old facility. Until someone figures a way to crack it open, we're just sifting through dirt. I'll figure it out. Well, thank you for everything, Lex. You got it, bub. So you run this place? Yes and no. The Sprat Shack used to be a shipping and receiving warehouse during the old Project Gorgon days. When Spacer's Choice pulled their guys off world, Sublight moved in to uh, salvage what we could, and they put me in charge. Why do you put salvage in quotations, I wonder? So then Sublight is the one that owns the Sprat? Uh, Sprat Shack now? Yes and no. <laughs> Rumor has it there's a Sprat wandering around the Groundbreaker. And he's the legal owner of the Sprat Shack. Hagen's idea. What? <laughs> what in the world just happened? Dare I ask, why a Sprat, uh, a Sprat owns the bar? See, Hagen didn't want a paper trail that led back to her. So she gave the bar to the Sprat. If there were any legal problems with this place, the Sprat would do the time. 
Uh. Oh, I, 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 uh, I don't know what to say to that. <laughs> uh, fascinating. Thanks for the legal insight. As far as business arrangements go, this one's a head scratcher, but they say it's all above board, so that's what matters. Sure, if you say so. Does Basis Choice mind that you're squatting in their warehouse? Yes and no. It's yes and no We're for everything. We're a lot more than squatting. We're classing up the joint, keeping the riffraff outside where it belongs. They didn't even serve drinks until I arrived. Talk about wasted potential. Um. Can, can you answer any questions without saying yes and no? I was just talking about that. Yes. And no. <laughs> Again, that one was Hagen's idea. She told me that speaking in vague terms keeps you out of trouble. And I don't want any trouble in my place. Got it. Makes sense. How do you get supplies in and out? Thirsty people come and go from all over the colony. Mostly on the way to somewhere better. Some are well-connected. And not everyone pays with bits. That's how we get the unconventional goods anyhow. Sublight keeps us well stocked with the essentials. By which I mean booze. Good to know. Well, I'm going to go have a look around upstairs on the third floor since I have to go make my way up there again. But thank you for the chat, Lex. I appreciate it. Good. I've got paying customers. <clears throat> Rude. She was a sweetheart until she said that. Sarcastic remark. But it's okay, though. Gotta make my way all the way upstairs again. This game does look great on the Series X, I must so say. All right, so what do we have here? Get out of my way. Lucky's case notes. Oops, wrong button. Day one. Space's choice may have left in a hurry, but they didn't forget to lock the doors on their way out. Most of the facilities are sealed up tighter than a top runger's safe. What's a top runger? I don't know. Uh, time to do some digging. Day six. Caught a day. Cut a break today. Met a scavenger who claims to be a salesman for Spacious Choice. Sold me a key uh, to the Office of Creative in Incubation. Let's just say this guy is about to get... Uh, uh, it's about a lucid... Is, it, man, I'm getting tongue twisted here. Let's just say this guy's about as lucid as a Sprat in a Rizzo's factory. But I'm se uh, spending Minnie's bits so I can afford uh, to take a chance. Day seven, it worked. Clarence mostly, whoever you are, I'm drinking to you tonight. Day 10, Olivia Ambrose, hey, Olivia. Wait, Olivia, that's that's the mom. It has to be, right? Olivia, Olivia Ambrose's uh, office and journal ought to be in the synthesis of manufacturing uh, center. The bad news is uh, it's sealed up and at the ass end of the canyon. The good news is I should be able to open it from the Bigwig's admin terminal in OCI. Day 13. OCI is crawling with marauders and I have got a few other ledgers to chase down. Could be nothing, but my gut tells me there's more uh, to this place than a missing journal. Time to turn over a few rocks and see what crawls out. I'm leaving the OSI key in the safe. The combo is 4 8 one five perfect let's look at this one though several whiskeys in and a few bits short uh last night gave lex the maintenance room key while i scrounged up what i owed note to self pay up and get it back before you go back to osi or oci can i not take this one okay so i need to get the key from lex apparently unlock with code Preserved eye? A carefully preserved eyeball, mostly intact. I bet you this is like for like retina scans or something. It's like a key. Pick up Lucky's trail at the Sprat Shack. Enter the office of creative incubation. Okay, so but before I go there, I have to get something from Lex. Let's talk to her again and see if we can get it from her what's your pleasure did lucky leave a key with you by any chance as a matter of fact he did 
collateral for the bar tab he was racking up. So I guess it's mine now. And no, you can't have it. Uh, fuck! 6,800 bits? Oh, wait. As the vice president of Salve uh, Sublight Salvage, I order you to give me that key. Yes, sir. <laughs> Here you go. I didn't mean to insult your authority. Honest. Will there be anything else, sir? <laughs> nah, no, I'm good. Thank you, Vex. Come back when you're thirsty. Oh, I'm thirsty, I. Right. I'm just kidding. Uh, let me see here. Order verifier. Is this an elevator? It is. Oh, hey, duh. This is where I came in from. What am I? What am I talking about? Ocular verifier. Yeah, it's definitely a key. Definitely, definitely a key. Let's get out of here and then check on the map how far this specific place is before we head out to our new area. This map? This map is actually pretty big, all things considering. Alright, so we are here. It's not very far because the furthest we got, I think... We came down here and then we went up here and we went to the secret hideout. So we were in the vicinity. So it's maybe 400 meters, something like that. Let's see what it is. Yeah, 430 meters. Man, I'm good. I am good. So all I got to do is go down the canyon, just basically go straight and then make a right at the end of the canyon. What's up here though? Interesting. All right, let's go make our way over there now. How do I get out of here again? Oh yeah, down here. This should be interesting. Can I look at this? Of course it's empty. Because why would it give me anything? Let's check. Or let's at bare minimum discover these. I think I might have already done so. Alright, yeah, I did already. Alright, let's get out of here. Ocular thing, I'm coming for you. Luckily though, I don't have to kill these raiders that are on this spaceship anymore since I already killed them all. But the objective is... I'm... I think I'm gonna make a left instead of a right once I get over there also there's a way up there but I'm not gonna just I'm not gonna go that way quite yet I feel like that's just gonna lead to a whole separate area like uh, instead of the lower parts of this canyon we would be on the top parts of the canyon and I'm, I'm willing to bet that's just something that I have to do later on but who knows we'll see we'll make the determination a little bit later so for now, let's just go ahead and keep walking. We're already almost there, dude. We're already two thirds of, or uh, tw uh, seventy-five percent of the way there. Ooh, frost! You magic! My magic really doesn't do much to him, does it? Get out of here, you manta pillar! what you get so these are new this is a shiver pillar not a manta pillar and this is a frost sore soldier that's interesting so that's the that's it right there okay so let's look at the map so there's that way and then there's this way I want to take a look over here you never know what we're gonna find before I head out in the other direction. Abandoned mines discovered. Huh. This place isn't that big, but I'm willing to bet this is probably where like the manta, the, uh, not the manta pillar, the frost sore, like queen or something is. This looks like a layer. Give me, give me, give me. You know what I should have done? Should have sold some stuff to Lex while I was there. What does that say? Frost or Soldier. Okay, so these are just soldiers, so I should be good. Happy birthday. You need to stop hitting people. Oh, God. He scared me. Those Manta Pillar thingies are really annoying. Oh, juke you, buddy. It's all those years I played soccer. Marauder crack shot. I'll be taking that. Thank you. You're providing for my financial needs in the future. 
your death has not been in sacrifice. Although you are a marauder, so you would have I would have probably killed you anyways. So what is that thing? It's just another frost sword. This should be easy. What's in here? Nothing. Oh, what is this thing? What is going on? Benji. You remember that time? He's dying. That time we... Yeah, Vision. Down on Stellar Bay. You read my mind, Benji. Black sun on the water. Waves glinting like... Like teeth. Swallows whole. That sky. <laughs> He's tore up. The rock. It's whispering, Benj. Dwayne, Dwayne Johnson's whispering? Yeah, I hear it too. Wants me to crawl. Crawl down deep. Let the beast consume. Mr. Beast. Benji. Can, can't hear you. You breathing? Ben? Ben? Aww. This sounds like a very close friends or maybe a love interest or something. I'm not sure. That's sad. It sounds like he died in, in serious pain. Oh, I'm frozen. I missed. And I'm slow. Well, that's an interesting thing that's happening. Is that it? Is that all that's here? I really thought there was going to be like some sort of a... Uh, remodeled... Oh, these are new skins. That's pretty cool. Pulse hammer gold. This thing is pretty strong. Alright. I really thought there was going to be more to this place. Oh, wait. There is more to this place. Oh, no. Which way did I come from? I came from here, obviously. Okay, so I came from up there. So let's go up in this direction. Maybe we'll find something else. I'm willing to bet that this is the, the headquarters, if you will. Oh no, because that's where I killed those other guys. Does this all lead to the same place? No, there's nothing up here. So let's go in this direction then. No, there's nothing. Because this is where I killed those... Things. Okay, I guess they're all dead. Let's go. Let's get out of here. There's literally nothing here. Oh, wait. I didn't go up there. I almost missed this whole spot right here. Can I talk to you really quick, sir? We have something to discuss. Come. Come. Thank you for listening. A dream. Get. Stop twitching. There you go. Come here, little manta pillar. Oh, God, I missed. I missed again. Well, that was a very. What just happened? Oh, God. I'm happy that I have a lot of health with this character. That thing would have probably killed me. What is that thing? Flywheel, by, uh, bypass shunt, and mag, uh, uh, mag picks. Examine. Virgil, making process on the graph planting for, uh, plating for the package. Uh, though not nearly as fast as, uh, you'd like. Given the spin rate of Gorgon, the anomaly I've been observing is only present in the sky three hours. But out of every 24, it doesn't, uh, doesn't, ah, I'm getting tongue twisted. Uh, every three hours out of every 24. Doesn't help that I have to readjust my telescope every couple of minutes to keep tabs on the slippery bastard. Come by my workstation outside the manufacturing uh, dome 
when you've got a minute the data's missing the data this thing is throwing off is strange as all get out but be uh be ashamed uh to compromise the package with a misplaced zero right by the way i checked on eustace the fumes aren't doing him any favors we ought to get him out there out of there as soon as we can how's your sister coming with the schedule by the marvelous mustache of excel maurice p.s you got to tell uh birdie to stop bringing me food if i have to eat another damned can of salt tuna fillets i'm gonna hurl so that's probably why the guy was throwing up upstairs. Pick up the exhilarating adventures of Archibald Exesser issue number two. A comic from the cult classic Ace Ex sure series uh, tragically canceled after this after its brief four issue run. Scribbled in uh, felt tip, the, uh, the comic spine is the word friend. After this run in with a dancing queen, proven hero ultra bar bald exalistor is mending its broken heart in its glitzy city of fairview when a horde of vicious crystal candidates escape from the laboratory of evil unemployed scientists as the candidates turn the city to ash with their plasma beam eyes exalistor sire uh i can't pronounce that word for some reason Descends into the depths of the lab to put down the leader of the pack, King Alpha. The king convinces to sabotage Excelsior's trusty pet and uh, our hero is forced to fight with the only weapon in reach. The skull of King Alpha's own mother, Express Crystalline Alpha. Will our Miss... Mi mustached hero escaped the king's jaws a heal and heal its wounds a uh, wounded heart i don't know we'll find out i suppose oh dialogue between dead men that was one one of the things that the guy wanted there's a ton of dead people around here all right i'll be taking that i kind of want to pick this up Eh, let's pick it up. Does this give me light? Oh, it's a legendary. It's a unique. I want to see something real quick. No, it doesn't. I was going to see if uh, it gave me the ability to cast light, but, I, but it doesn't. Cool, we found our first unique other than the one when we killed Minnie. All right, so how do I get out of here again? I think it was this way. Or not. I think it was this way, actually. Honestly, I don't know. Let's just jump down. It's probably the best and quickest and more most efficient way to get there. So let's go make our way inside the OCI. Since it's literally right here and a part of the main quest. For the DLC, so it should be pretty interesting to find out what's going on in here. Office of Creative Incubation. So we got some raiders over here. Let's check out the map. So this looks like a dead end too. You know what? Yeah, we're we're going. We are going. We'll check out the creative incubation later. Dude, that was a twofer. Alright, stand by. I'll get you in a second. You can continue shooting. Do your thing, bro. It's not like you're gonna do anything anyways. Excuse me. Alright. Oh, God. <laughs> that dude literally just offed himself. All right, so this is interesting. What do we have here? Some more bits. How many bits do I have now? 2,700 already? That didn't 
didn't take long. We came in here with like a hundred... I keep wanting to say caps, but with uh, like a hundred bits and that's pretty much it. And now we have over 2,000, almost 3,000 as a matter of fact. That really did not take long, did it? Ooh. Defaced Moonman Helmet. Intimidate 10 Lie 5. That's cool. I thought that was going to be a unique item for a second, but it's not. It's just it's just a variation of the Moonman Helmet, which is cool. So I'm assuming we're going to see quite a few of them in this world. So there's that. Dude, I'm getting all kinds of stuff here. Who are you? A crack shot. Sir, it's not it's not healthy to take crack. Get out of here. Would you stop? It's not good for your health when you try to hit me, bro. Oh, that was cool. Show me that again. Or not. You could always melt. Worker domicile? Who just shot me? Oh, right there I see you. You're hiding behind the pole. Come here. Oh my god. Finally. You're getting in the way of my looting, bro. I want to look up here. What's up here? Oh, corrosive weakness. No, thank you. I would definitely not have any form of weakness. I'm going to go upstairs in a second, but since this is just right here, I might as well check this out first. So I can't pickpock or lockpick that or that. I literally can't lockpick anything, really. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. This weapon really is strong, man. I really enjoy this weapon. A ring. Dude, I'm going to be able to sell all kinds of stuff. Dude, I'm going to be rich literally overnight. This guy has really high strength, too. So, it gives me quite a lot of carry weight. Also, I probably should start scrapping some armor. Now that I think about it, so I could get some armor mods. That would be the smart thing to do. I'll do that later. Oh, speaking of the devil. There's some weapon and armor mods right there. Wait, what's in here? A lot of stuff that I won't be needing. So, I think that's everything here those things sound absolutely disgusting but let me check around this corner just in case i'm missing anything oh i thought i heard a beep dude there's so much stuff in here look at all the stuff i'm getting dude i'm gonna be i'm telling you i'm gonna be absolutely filthy rich it's going to be so filthy that by the time I take a shower, it, it's not going to make a difference because I'm so, so, so filthy rich. Okay. Well, now let's go outside. Or upstairs, I mean. Uh, I hope I don't have to lockpick anything or hack into anything because... Yeah, I don't have very high anything. Like, literally, all I have high is, like, all of my melee skills... And science, but that's only for this weapon. And really, that's that's about it. This thing looks cool. But it doesn't look like it's very useful for anything. So let's go ahead and just continue on. Anyone up here? No? Okay. Good to know. This thing got absolutely destroyed, didn't it? Nothing. Some weapon mods. That's great. Man. Hunting rifle. Whoop. Broken legs it is. Wait, did I? Oh, that's the other side. Yeah, so I came up that way. I killed one of the snipers here. So let's explore this one. This one looks more interesting because of the red. 
And of course I have to lockpick, which I don't have. So there's that. Wait, before I go, I need that. Wow, this is definitely very interesting, man. This DLC so far. Really am enjoying it a lot. And this is still the beginning. Grenade launcher three. I could even sleep if I wanted to. Cooling again. Nothing. There was nothing up here though. So that's unfortunate. So which way did I go? Did I look inside this building? Uh oh. I don't think I looked inside this building. Of course. You have a bunch of really good stuff on you. Thank you very much. I really appreciate your contribution to my well-being and just period overall safety. Alright. I think that's good in this area. So which way did I come from? Let's blow this up. Oh! I thought I could get back in time. So I think I came from... No, that's the way I need to go. Because I came from this way, right? Dude, I got... Hold on, which way did I come from? I'm so confused right now. Yeah, I came from this way. Yeah, okay, so I'm on the right track now. And I just searched this right here. So now it's more this way. You! He was not expecting that. You need to relax, sir. My health is so high that I can literally just take my time. Dude, that's very impressive and all, but I need you to stop moving. Appreciate the show and tell as far as your capabilities to dodge, though. Alright, we'll be taking all of your stuff. Well, that I can actually take. Alright, give me one quick second. Alrighty, back at it. My game was glitching again, so I have to fix that really fast. Alrighty. We're go we're golden. Those sprats, when they do that laughing sound, is that right there. I don't know if you guys heard it. It's uh it's very disturbing. Oh, this is an elevator? Oh duh, it says elevator discovered. Okay. Well I'm not gonna go up there. Yet. I want to clear out the whole bottom side first. Marauder Stronghold discovered. What are we going to find here? Marauder Colossus. Let's look around first. I'm going to take a quick... Not that I'm worried or anything. I'm pretty strong, but... I want to see how many people are actually here first before anything. So this is the sneaky way. Marauder Plunder. Eh, yeah, there's... There really isn't that many people here. Oh, there's somebody right... <gasps> That's Charles from Counting! What's that noise? Come here! We found Charles from Accounting. Oh, there goes this rocket launcher. Come here! Alright, let's go take care of Charles. Come here, Charles from accounting. Oh, he is tanky. He took two hits. Ooh. Ooh. It's a, it's a... Hold on, you need to relax, bro. Okay, hold on. We'll check out that science weapon in a second. Goodbye. Alright, I gotta check it out. So, weapons. Science. Special delivery, manufacturer unknown, science weapon. Originally designed as an experimental mail delivery tool. This l mail delivery tool? What in the world? Uh, this launcher was listed as a failed project and forgotten. Gee, I wonder why. With its recent discovery and retrofitting, its homing pneumatic tubes are now fitted with explosive explosives to deliver death rather than envelopes oh i got it it was mode uh it was modified post 
Got it. Makes sense. That's cool, though, that they added more science weapons. I like that. I like that a lot, actually. Anything else interesting to find around here? Sorry to break it to you, Charles from accounting. But, uh, I think you're dead. Why is a corporate commander here anyways? That's a spacer's... Well, I mean, I guess... I guess it makes sense. Because that is a spacer's choice. Uh, corporate commander, so... It makes absolute sense. Did I look over here? I'm not entirely sure, but we're gonna do it anyways. Ooh. What is this thing? Plasma cutter titanium. I wonder how much that does for me. 2,851. That's, that's, it's not bad. Man, I'm willing to bet there was something cool in here too, but, oh, well, can't get it. How much is my carry weight? 125 out of 140. I should probably go sell some stuff. What? Stupid rock. Alright, let's go discover this place then, and then we're gonna... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Perfect. Yeah, let's go discover this place, and then we're going to immediately fast travel back to the homeboy by the ship. Only so that we can sell everything we have gotten so far. Which should probably give us like a thousand more bits. Hopefully. I can only cross my fingers at this point because right now we have what literally we're on the threshold of uh within the threshold of 3,000 so this should definitely put us well above 3,000 bits alrighty office of creative incubation that looks pretty freaking awesome dude I'm not gonna lie all right let's check this out real quick so we could fast travel here now that's exactly what I was hoping to see let's take a look around though really quick ooh what's this thing let's call I thought I knew the OCI backwards and forwards the marauders got a way of finding every nook and cranny on this rock OCI fancy joint smells like Wentzworth's and leather a real slice of Byzantium you don't set that up unless you're planning something big. Adrena time? Sure. But something tells me there's more to the story. Got a hunch to follow up on near the old mines. I'm leaving this here. In case I gotta come back. Got it. Alright. So. Let's check on this side actually real quick. I think I already did but. I missed something. No I didn't. Okay, yeah, since we could fast travel here, let me see the map. Okay, we can fast travel there. That's a good thing. Let's go ahead, fast travel. I guess we could go... Yeah, a Sprat Shack exterior. That's perfect. And then we'll talk to the guy that's right here. Because I can't sell to vending machines. I don't think... I think it requires a skill, perhaps, to be able to use. I could buy stuff, but I can't sell anything. Really quick though, we should probably start... Let's break down a few things. We'll break down that and then put everything else into scrap. Without actually getting rid of our nice little science weapon that we just picked up. Okay, so there's that. That's cool, man. All right, let's break that down though. We definitely need to break some of these down so that I can repair my armor. And then, well, we'll do two more. And then we'll just sell everything else. Keeping, of course, our legendaries and uniques. Wait a minute. I haven't seen this, have I? Check electricity rating, rationing bill. Electricity uh, rationing is effect is in effect. By accessing this terminal, you consent to paying one bit per every option selected. That's fine. Okay, so employee uh, Tran Dominic uh, currently owes nine thousand five hundred and eight bits. Okay, 
What the? F I am not paying his bill. But I'm sure I get something for that, though. Outgoing shipments. Uh, cartoons containing redacted, three discharged staff, five reassigned staff. Okay, return to outgoing shipments. Uh, a lot of redacted stuff. Three hundred fifty cartoons. There's a lot of. Okay. Nothing important. Although I wonder what happens if you pay the bill. Law and organization. Okay, good to know. So where's this vendor? Okay, we're back at the Sprat Shack. There he is, right there. Oh wait, you know what? I st I still need to get rid of consumables, don't I? Adrena time? I'm gonna hold it. Wait, what does this do again? Yeah, melee weapon attack speed. I'm gonna hold on to that. Whoops. My bad. Although I, I literally never use consumables other than the healing for some reason. I don't know, it's just, it's just not the way I play for some reason. Hey again, stranger. Hey, what's up, man? What can I get you? Uh, I actually need to sell some stuff to you, please. All sorts of salvage and weapons. And plenty of. You don't say. Okay, so I can afford this now. I'm debating if I should buy it or not. It didn't take very long to get 6,000 bits. I think I'm going to hold off for a second just in case I'm going to need it for something else. Uh... But yeah, how do I get up there? That looks cool though. All right, let me see the map. Okay, so there's, yeah, there's clearly a way to get up there. There's the, the gate that's right there. It looks like. Oh no, wait. No, that's for this spot right here. Cause I could just go around this. So. That's the way up there, right there. So I have to be able to get up into that mansion somehow. Yep. Alright, but for now, let's go ahead and fast travel to the OSI. So that we can continue on with this quest in finding... Well, finding out a lot of things like what happened in detail to Lucky. The whole situation with Minnie and Olivia and everything so let's go ahead and go inside <laughs>